Hi, my name is Chris Villarino and I'm going to show you how to make a horizontal rolling transition that you can use on your music videos, travel vlogs, and all kinds of video content. So let's get started. If you're into video editing, filmmaking, or content creation, consider subscribing to my channel for weekly videos. Now on to our topic. The first thing you need to do is create an adjustment layer. Go to Project Panel, click on New Item on the bottom right, and select Adjustment Layer. Now once that adjustment layer appears among your assets in the Project Panel, drag that over to your timeline on top of the two shots, the outgoing and the incoming shot that you want to apply this transition to. Trim that adjustment layer to 16 frames, more or less, since this transition works best when it goes by really quick. On your effects panel, look for the Distort folder and pick Offset. Drag that over to your adjustment layer and that should bring up the effects controls. Now on that effect, you will only need the Shift to Center function where you will find horizontal and vertical parameters. So drag your playhead to the beginning where you want the transition to kick in and create a keyframe. This should go right over your outgoing shot. Now go to the final frame of the transition, which should be in your incoming shot. Click and drag the horizontal parameter. Go on as far as you want until you achieve the desired times you want your transition to roll. Now you'll want to make sure your final image lands exactly in full frame, so you might need to really manually adjust. So once that's done, go back to the Distort folder in the Effects panel and look for Lens Distortion. A nice distortion will exaggerate the transition and will really call attention to this effect itself. Now you'll only really need the curvature function in there, so click and drag that to achieve the desired distortion. But what you don't want is for the transition to kick in distorted right away. So create a keyframe with the image already curved, more or less midway through the transition. Then go to the beginning and type zero. So now we see it curve gradually. And then type zero at the end so it comes back to normal. So the final step is to add a directional blur, which you will find in the effects panel under the blur and sharpen folder. Adjust the direction of the blur and since the transition is a horizontal roll, it only makes sense that the blur is more horizontal. Apply that and animate the blur length in time with the curvature. Type in a value for when it's most blurred. Type zero in the beginning and in the end. And that's it, that's a quick horizontal roll transition. You can make your own adjustments, customize it more to your footage. Apply some ease and adjust the Bezier to your liking. I've also uploaded a preset for this transition for which I will post the link on the description below. So once you've downloaded that, you just go to Presets, right click and select Import Presets. Look for the downloaded file and you should find that under Presets. Just create an adjustment layer and then apply my preset and you're good to go. So that's all I got for today. If you like this video, give us a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, click that little bell so you'll be notified whenever I post a video. My name is Chris Villarino and I will see you again soon.